Hello, uh, my name is Waidullah Sagaf. I am uh, from Yemen and I'm uh, studying uh, information technology law program uh, in Tartu University. Uh, well, today we're going to answer some questions about you know school in uh, Tartu University, life in Estonia and in Tartu. So yeah, let's go. Let's start. Well, I think information technology law is really big. Honestly, like oh, when I came to before I come here, actually I th I thought it's only about uh, uh, privacy issues, but no, actually it's there's so many things. Uh, actually, information technology law is almost in all parts of law. For example, if you talk about criminal law, there is uh, cyber crime. Uh, yeah, there is uh, human trafficking in in, uh, in this area, and there is uh, cyber law, which is I mean like international hacking between countries even could happen so yeah and in business yeah there is also you know how to uh, raise a startup how to put you know the structure of startup and yeah how to do these things for startup and yeah what else um, also yeah i said privacy issues uh, and um, also there is something about uh, you know blockchain technology and how to implement it and how to do it in uh, financial technology Honestly, it's a big field, but you need really to read more about it. One of my favorites, I would say, it's uh, data privacy and data protection. It's, it's interesting because it talks about a major thing now what's happening, which is uh, protecting data and protecting privacy. And yeah, it's a really interesting field. It's kind of complicated, it's, but it's interesting, yeah. That's one of the cool, actually, subjects. One of these things, actually, is, uh, um, you know, as a law students, we have something called moot court. Moot court is like, you know, like a real life court, and there are judges, and there is, uh, you know, like lawyers, and the, everyone defend their, their position. So yeah, we have something like this, and it's uh, it's part of the school, like it's official, like it's graded. So yeah, it's really interesting. It's really kind of makes you nervous at the beginning, but it's when you go through it, it's really an amazing experience. Yeah, that's one of the coolest thing. And also we we had like uh, I can call it an internship that the university asks you that you have to do some legal work for a startup. In Estonia, you have to look for a startup in, in Estonia and you have to provide some legal help for them, you know. And maybe you might continue working with them later in the future. That's between you and them. Yeah, actually, the most exciting thing is that, you know, Estonia is, you know, technology hub, you know, the leader in tech, you know, stuff like this. I was really. And also, this, you know, startup movement thing, it's really an interesting thing. and. Uh, yeah, if you are really uh, like kind of related to this thing, take full, uh, you know, advantage of this thing. Yeah, it's a really cool thing. You will see a lot of uh, startups. You will see a lot of convey, like uh, talks and a lot of networking events here. You will see a lot of young guys, you know, and girls into this thing. So yeah, I think you will love this thing. Well, I noticed. Yeah, actually, it's sport bubble and. Tartu University. Yeah, we have the gymnasium here and the gym area. And uh, yeah, uh, I see all the time here like there is a volleyball, so whether it's indoor or on summer it's a beach volleyball. So yeah, actually, people are really into sports, which is uh, something really cool. Honestly, my program is really challenging. Uh, at the beginning, you know, I'll tell you something in Tartu University, like if you think you're gonna come here and you think it's gonna be like a little bit easy or yeah, it's gonna be a walk in the park now, it's not gonna be like that. It's to be really challenging, guys. Yeah, and uh, my program it actually is, uh, yeah, it's really challenging. There is a lot of, uh, a lot of assignments, a lot of projects that you have to do and a lot of presentations and uh, yeah, a lot of research that you will do. And uh, yeah, it will be really intense. Like you will have a lot of things to do within a short uh, time. So yeah, that's one of the challenges of the program. Actually, the uh, my faculty in each program there is a like a tutor, the volunteer Estonian uh, 
tutor and uh, this person actually they show you how to how they try to settle you in here and if you have any question uh, they try to help you as soon as possible so yeah this thing was uh, was uh, was really good thing and also you know uh, our program they they have a facebook group and they have a facebook uh, page so we got to it's really like get uh, got us together uh, easily so we connected with, with each other before even arriving to to Estonia so yeah I don't think you will have issue with this you know and even if you like you like we had a whatsapp group and this was made by students so if you feel like there's nothing like that maybe you should make one and I think you will get people with you so yeah uh, I think there are available internship here in Estonia and even in Europe uh, how do you find them I think you find them through the Tartu student affair I think as far as I know and we always get actually through our email uh, some newsletter each week for uh, the available internships. So yeah, there are so many internships, you know, you just need to look for them and yeah, apply. The most valuable thing in the program... Um, I think the, one of the, thing, the cool things about this program is I teach you how to you look for the information you search for the information and when you search for the information yourself I think you will learn more yeah that's one of the things I liked about this program yeah, it was really t time consuming and of course you'll put a lot of effort but yeah that's one thing I noticed about this program well actually after my degree I would love to have some professional experience in uh, Estonia in legal field I think it really will be valuable experience for me and I'm really looking forward to do that.